WF South Africa. Tara, good evening. Good evening, welcome. Natasha. Thanks. Okay, so tell us about this campaign um, and the hashtag I'm for Rhinos. Okay, so what we set out to do was to create a unique hashtag, uh, I am for Rhinos. On Twitter, uh, you define conversations by having a hashtag um, and getting people to tweet that uh, to get the message out about the plight of Rhinos and poaching in South Africa, which has reached, as you know, epidemic proportions. So we, uh, we went with a very ambitious target of trying to get a million tweets with this hashtag um, and and in so doing uh, to influence the way people uh, well first of all that people understand we in South Africa know perfectly well uh, that rhinos are in terrible trouble but it's not an issue that's top of mind for many people around the world so this was really a campaign to start it in, in South Africa to create a, a, a strong trend in South Africa on Twitter and then to explode it into a global Twitter storm which is what we, we have managed to achieve okay so you're aiming at a million tweets what are the numbers like at the moment okay so that was a little ambitious we have to admit. <laughs> <laughs> a million tweets has never been done before. In fact, we're looking up some records this evening uh, and the top Twitter, Twitter campaign that we can find uh, was for the London Olympics. It was uh, one year to go and that only reached 165,000. Okay. So that was the top one we can find. We're sitting at about 130,000 tonight at okay. the moment. So that's 130,000 individual tweets that have been pledged to am for Rhinos, which is actually completely remarkable considering in South Africa we are not exactly the world's biggest population we're not the world's biggest uh, internet uh, users we, we aren't you know we don't have a massive Twitter population so to be to be talking like at numbers like that 130 million tweets uh, 130,000 tweets pledged it's quite quite remarkable we, 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 we're very proud and very thankful to you South Africans for, for picking up this campaign okay I mean it, it is remarkable because Twitter is not um, it's it's a relatively new form of social media. That's right. Yeah. So, um, where would you see this going? I mean, is it sustainable? Well, uh, you mean the campaign? Yeah. Well, we're going to stop it at, at midnight. At midnight tonight. I think okay. we've all spammed our friends. We've all uh, we, we've all exhausted. Yeah, our I think I've tweeted four or five times <laughs> today. That hashtag. <laughs> so, so people, we don't want we don't want people to get fatigued. Yeah. I think we've proved we've 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 done it. We've glo we've trended in South Africa for five days. We can't think of another campaign that's actually achieved that. And we actually have hit the global trends. We hit number one spot on global trends on a weekend that, as you know, has been packed with news. So so we have achieved what we set. What what we set out to do. Um, so we're going to stop it at midnight, but, we'll, but there is a website, iamforrhinos.com. You can still pledge. Please, people must still pledge tonight okay. because we want to break that record, that mm -hmm. London Olympics record, which by the way, they took a year. I mean, we, we can do this in five days. Five we can days, beat the record. Yeah. So people just tweet tonight, I'm for rhinos still. And then the website, iamforrhinos.com, has got a rhino that's filling up with, with um, as, as, as the tweets are pledged, the rhino's filling up. We're not going to, we, uh, we're not going to stop the conversation we want people still to talk about it. We still want people in the world to realize the problem, and especially in the East where the, where the, uh, the, where the markets are. Um, but but the, the conversation will not be about just getting the million tweets from midnight. It will be about um, how to save our rhinos from, from then on. So the hashtag will continue. Okay, so who specifically were you targeting? I mean, were there big names locally, internationally? Because not everybody follows Twitter. <clears throat> so, you know, Twitter is very unpredictable, and people are unpredictable. So we went for, first we started with ordinary South Africans, ordinary people who just, rally to the call. They, 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 they started to tweet in their thousands um, and we called on them to pressurize their favorite celebrities, people with really large Twitter followings, four, five hundred thousand, a million, two million. This afternoon Stephen Fry tweeted, he's got over six million followers. Yeah. Um, and, and so, so it, we, we called on people to call on their favorite celebrity or, 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 or their favorite star, sports stars, I mean all of South Africa's cricket team, India's, India's uh, cricketers, Australia's rugby players and New Zealand's rugby players, Bolly, the whole of Bollywood, a lot of Bollywood has tweeted for us. Clarence House, Prince William's account, tweeted um, for Rana. So, so it, started, it started and it has been a campaign that really is about ordinary people making a difference, just a simple pledge, I am for Rana's, but celebrities around the world have picked it up. Okay, brilliant. So I will have to leave it there. We've run out of time, unfortunately, but thank you very much for Thanks coming Thanks very much. In. Please do pledge, make a pledge, I am for Rana's again. Indeed, I will. <laughs>